they go, hey man, can you play this guitar with boobs on it? How am I supposed to do that? I just want to look right there. This is uh, Marilyn Monroe's Playboy centerfold shot. And there's boobs, man! Boobies! Yeah! Okay, we all like boobies. Okay, I get it. You get it. That's it. 1994. Um, Playboy 40th anniversary guitar. 175 of these were made in 1994. All airbrushed by Pamelina. Paulina? Pamelina Reich. Pamelina. Right. And th it's, uh, this is a mint condition. I think I'm the first guy to play this guitar. Uh, there's a sticker where the hole is for the, uh, the whammy bar. Because nobody ever put one in there before. It's a virgin. It's a virgin. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, yeah, man. Okay. So, I'm in the Vox AC30 in the neck pickup. Okay. Now, guitar sounds good. Okay. Neck pickup. Vox AC30. <laughs> I don't know why I played that. Let's, let's, oh, we got five way here. Five way. So that's. This is the fourth position. Ah, we do that. Mm. Couldn't stand the weather. Stevie Ray Vaughan. Ah. Accidentally hit it and it went in the middle position. And you're going, hey, the tone, the tone changed, and that's why. So we're in the second, third position. I'm sorry, third position. And then, in the second position, is the famous. Okay, something like that. Um, going into the Tone Monster to give you a little bit of this. Okay, um, you know what? I played that in a band once, but we did it in the key of A. And uh, so that's the only key I know the solo in, in A. Wait. And the, so the guitar player in the nag played the solo on the Les Paul. But I'm not playing a Les Paul, but I am doing my Sharona, so I'm going to try the solo on this guitar. Uh, before the solo. <laughs>
I lost it. I haven't played that solo, I swear, on everything I hold holy in 10 years. <laughs> All right. Wait, no, I should take that back. Maybe it's been seven years. Yeah, I got lost in a couple of places. That's an awesome solo, and I lost my pick. Yeah, there's another one. And woo! Okay, man. I remember going to see the movie Heavy Metal when I was a kid in the theater. That's a long time ago. Ow! But, um, so I got this strat with boobs on it, and I'm, uh, and then they can check on the, uh, headstock. And, uh, I got, uh, the Tone Monster happening. And, uh, so I'm gonna do Heavy Metal, man. It goes like this. Oh, yeah! That's coming back, man. That song's awesome. Okay, so this is a solo of I Wish My Beer Was As Cold As Your Heart for you guys that have requested a lesson on it. First, I'm going to do it fast. Not, not fast, but the tempo of the song, I think. I think it's something like that. I wish my beer was as cold as your heart. Ow! Suck it! <laughs> so, it's really hard to play it. I'm missing a lot of frets. I do it on a 24 fret. I had to improvise at the end there. Okay, let's go clean. Nice and slow. This is what I call my Phil X banjo lick. Because there's always a string ringing out, and that's why it sounds so confusing. So, I go like... Sounds ugly all by itself. But that's the first lick. <laughs> Did you catch that? So the next part, it's uh... Mm. And this lick is kind of cool too, it goes... So what I'm doing there is kind of like uh... On the, on, the, on the 24 fret guitar I can move it down, I can go like, I'll do it in D. So I'll go... So that's what I'm actually doing. So it sounds kind of crazy because it almost sounds like two guitars, but what I'm doing is taking a unison bend and moving it around. So in this case, in E, I had to go. Yeah, I'm in the mode, except I wasn't tuned down, so I couldn't keep going. All right. Um, hey, that's it, man. Nice guitar with boobs on it. Titties! Uh, Phil X signing off. Ow! <laughs>